Alright, well, hello and welcome to another fabulous little episode here at yours truly with the beautiful thing that I'm creating here with the CBD products and everything that they do. And there's a whole realm of different products that are listed within the products that I share between CBD oil, things that it can be used for with pets. And all the other great elements that are in there that you'd be able to see that I will go ahead and drop the product line in there and you, you look at each one of those. Now, what I'm doing is I'm running this to the fullest to the realm. And I want to bring in as many people as possible for a reason. I'm looking to change the way things happen and work. Now, you tell me this. So many doctors that are behind it understand what CBD can do, right? And yet, there they are. And then, if when they do decide to have it on their shelf and it somewhere within their facility and they want to, you know, giving it to you and whatnot, wait to see the price tag, right? That's because they understand. Nerd mind thinking is, well, huh, I should have jumped on this wagon a long time ago. You know, I said it before, and I'll say it again. Those that have joined me in many different ventures that I've been in and I support and that I do, been to many seminars, webinars, motion speaker, you name it, done it, been there, done it. And have I been in front of people? Yes, I have. Did people understand it? Some did, some didn't, some get it, some did, some don't, right? So I said, listen, the train is in front of you. Now is the time to get on board. Nobody needed a ticket. Come to the front of the caboose and join me, right? Each one of you has had the opportunity to be in the conductor and take that train as far as you wanted to go. Well, now, you not that you missed the train, it's that the train got longer. Alright, so you went from being the conductor to being somewhere be along the line of being and behind the, the conductor, right? You know how each train has their each conditional parts, right? And you got this one, coach one, coach two, the sleeper, whatnot, right? So as the train kept filling up and the train just kept moving, right? Now there's a ticket that's required, right? Sort of, kind of. Not my world, but in a lot of others. Mine is to say, you know what, I already know you. Welcome aboard. Have fun. Let's enjoy the journey together. That's why I'm doing what I'm calling it as the CBD Oil 120. Looking to connect with 120 people for 120 days. And there's a reason, there's a method between the reason why I chose 120. Why? Well, do the math. How long is 120 days, right? Why am I looking for 120 people? That's just the start. You know, I'd love for that number to go higher, but there's a reason why I chose that. It's to be in tune to being in for 120 days solid. Using the product, get to know the product, see all the fabulous things that it can do, and enjoy the journey. Right, and truly, you're going to see a lot more people, and I know quite a few people that are doing it, and they keep making their postings, right? But now you got to think, me, I love interaction with people. I get to know, or like to getting to know Everybody and everyone. Why? Because I don't cherry pick. In other words, I just don't look at somebody and go, yep, that's the only where I want to be, right? No. And I do not judge anyone before I actually get to know what they do. It's kind of like taking the book and you judge the cover by its book and you never open one page to even get to understand what that whole book is about, right? Well, 
that's why I began my journey. And it started with Global Exposure Business Networking with JDL. And then I connected it with Gimme of Global Exposure Business Network with JDL, right? And it was all connected to one. They all asked, well, what is Global Exposure Business Networking with JDL as well as Gimme, right? G-I-M-M-E. You say it fast and it's almost like you're saying give me, right? But it's like Gimme. You'd be surprised at how that word alone took a skyrocket, right? But I want it to go global. That's why I chose the word global. Networking was between everything and everything that there was on the World Wide Web. I didn't care because I'm open, as mo as everybody should be, you know. Don't knock it until you at least looked at it and understood, okay, this is this is what they want to do, right? Well, hey, everybody, that's why I say, listen, your success is everybody else's success, no matter if they get it or not. And I can tell you, I've been to many, many different areas, and I've walked up to them and I said, so tell me about you. What it is that you do? Why is it that whatever it is that you're presenting at the Time and what it is that you're doing, I ask, why is it that you do it? Why? What is the why, right? So there are questions that are in there that go along with that why. They have to have a passion, they have to have a drive, they have to have a goal, and they should be able to do it in their sleep. They should roll right off their tongue. No need to picking up a cue card. No need to reading from no special script. It should just flow. Just as anything else, right? That shows and should show somebody, hey, listen, this guy is not reading from some projector. He's not reading from some slide scripts. He's not reading some from some PowerPoint presentation. He's not showing this from another person's point of view on how they create it and present it, whatever it is, right? Put your own juice and your own energy into it, right? I found different ways in every way possible that anybody could market it anything that it is that they do and, and or currently does, right? You have to ask if this is what you're passionate about and this is what I want to do. Is this going to take me to where I want to be? Is this something that I want to put my full 110% focus? Now, there are a lot of people that say, well, you can only really be in one and not be in this, that, thing, and the other, right? Well, you should always have a plan A to a plan Z. That is, well, when plan A don't work, you're going to have a plan B, a plan C, and a plan D, and, that, and beyond, right? And then backwards even, right? To see if it's actually going to work. But you cannot, cannot. And I can't stress this enough. Only being it for a couple of moments and saying, this is not going to work. Well, you didn't give it enough time, right? You have to truly see where it's going to go and what, where it's going to take you, right? I can't tell you how many authors, how many things that came to my table. Hey, listen, take a look at this. Get behind what I'm doing and get involved in what I'm doing. Now, there are a uh, thousand of them there are millions of them out there excuse me and there have been a lot of people that asked me hey you know i'd love for you to join me this that thing you know why is it you want me to join you why now i want to hear your answer but i want your honest answer and i'm going to ask you certain questions that are probably going to throw you off me not even thought of and it's happened many a time and tell you I've done it many many times and then he always said well you know <laughs> that's a good point you hit on something that nobody's ever asked me never thought of asking me or wow how did you come to that right well it's a proof of point I want to see where your passion is and where your drive is and see exactly where you're at 
right? You gotta learn how to take control, right? Don't let anybody else try to be your part of your success. Now, they're having help behind you, yes, but they have to understand it along with you, right? They have to have the same passion, they have to have the same drive, and they have to understand it inside and out and be able to do it in their sleep, right? Wake up, smell it, taste it, whatever the scenario I'm being, be able to just be able to flow without no special scripts, no screenshots, no nothing, right? Just do it. I've done it. And I had a lot of excitement to where I do what I do, right? This is why people come to me and say, hey, listen, you should you just should just join me with this venture. It's just now starting to get into uh, the startup and it's ready to take off and once it does this is it well, we all heard them we've all seen them we've all done our thing right we all learn and that is what you need to do is learn and go from there to see that's why I said have a plan A have a plan B have a plan C there's nothing wrong being multiple platform software program networking business Whatever the scenario is, as long as you're capable of handling each one. And each one is going to require your time and your devotion, not to mention everything else behind it, right? Money-wise, right? And a lot of people don't understand it and they don't get it. They're like, well, I don't understand it. You know, I share all this stuff. I get this feedback out and da 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 and I just can't get anyone to come follow me in anything that I do or anything that I give them. La la. And yet, I go to look, and there they are, and I see some comments in there, and then it just drops off, fades out, right? That at least I see from one angle, right? Now, that's the prime opportunity to say, hey, listen, you know, thank you for the comment, and let's talk back and forth, one another. Let me get your ideas. If you feel that it's not a great fit for you, great. I don't hold no remarks. I don't hold no regrets. No nothing. Not for you, great. I much rather you be up and on about it. Say this is not for me. This I can't simply get behind this just because either I don't have the time, I don't have the passion, I don't have the drive, or this is just not my thing, right? And a lot of people look at you know how much generations it can be bought in right listen we all like making money and yeah it's nice right but you got to learn that money is not about it's not a, it's not as everything is what you expect it to be it's nice don't get me wrong it's great to have so that you can keep doing what you're doing yes but i've seen a lot of people get greedy right they start wanted to start way up here Right? They want to stop at the start at the top of the ladder before they even begin at the bottom, right? Listen, when you're a baby, you had to learn how to crawl before you could walk, then run, and just go woof. Right? Same concept in anything that is that you do. Because I'm gonna tell you something. When you want to start way up here and you are just getting in, and you thought that this is so great. And then let something happen. When you come from up there and you take that fall, depending on how far you are up there, let's say you're way up here, that's a definite hard fall and it's going to hurt. You're going to be like, wow, this hurt. I don't think I can dust my, myself off so easily and start this journey again, right? So when, yet when you're starting at the bottom, right? Now, when you kind of fall, you're just not even on that first step, or even if you are in that first step, it's not going to hurt so much. Well, okay, brush this off and work my way, right? It's kind of like when you build a building, where does it start? You have to have a ground, you have to have, okay, is this building going to, A, first of all, fit where I want it to be? Then I got to lay out how I want it to look. Then I have to lay, dig it up, then, you know, get the ground ready. Then I'm going to pour the foundation. Then I'm going to start building the structure. Then comes to the roof, and then come into the inside and make it look pretty. And then finally, open the doors, invite everybody in, enjoy, right? 
That's what I'm saying. So that's why I'm looking for now 120 people for 120 days. And it can only be with those that understand it, that are behind it, that have a drive, and then have a passion. And not afraid to open their mouth and talk to other people. That you just can't expect 120 people to fall in your lap when you're not saying nothing, right? As you notice, I keep posting these videos. I keep doing them every now and then. And I'm doing them for, for a reason, right? And I try to get to many different types of events, functions, get-togethers, and whatnot. And I truly love those events that come to me and they ask me to come out and give my support and be there for their support and everything else like that in between. Which is great because then that's when I can actually see them one-on-one, -on -one, get to know them, talk to them in person one-on-one. -on -one, Stepping outside of the World Wide Web, something that a lot of people have forgot, right? And technology, you gotta love it. It's gonna continue to change. And I've always said, what worked yesterday is not gonna work today. Because it's consistently changing, and you have to be on the constant move and up to what, where it is and where it's at and where it's going and beyond, right? So that's why I guess I'm kind of lucky being the guru that I am. I chose the passion and being behind everything about technology, where it's at, where it's going. Um, some of it is silly, but you didn't get to look at it and go, wow, okay. Now, could a lot of them be worked on and, you know, spruce a little better? Yeah. But listen, <laughs> it's just going to get more crazy and crazier, right? And then, of course, naturally, you know, time will tell to see what happens here. I mean... Um, I'm on a few different types of different new areas in the social media from Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, Referral, Tumblr, and a few others out there. And, you know, I pick and choose where I want to be, but Google truly is my best friend, as it should be for everybody else's, right? Hence why I keep doing and why I do what I do, right? And I've done the Google search, and I see where I come in and everything else like that, and there are others. Yeah, that's great. So, again, come with me. Take this journey with me. You know, I'm reaching out to as many people as I can right now. I want to take 120 people for 120 days, and there's a reason why I started with that. And then I'm sure it'll grow from there. And I don't care, you know, as long as you're with the United States, that's cool. That's fine. That's where this is really into, too. Um, a lot of those people that kind of see these, they kind of try to sneak in from out in Nigeria and everything else like that. Hey, listen, that's great. That's cool. But I know the certain boundaries to stay in and being, you know, selective where I'm at and what I do, right? Keep it in where, where you love best, right? And, you know... I'm all about support. I'm all about being one-on-one -on -one with people, a group of people. It don't matter. As long as you have a passion, you have a drive, you have a goal, and, you know, that must-do attitude. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, there's nothing wrong in being, like, here, there, there, and there, as long as you can handle that many. Only take on what you can really take on and have time doing it, right? I can't stress that enough, right? You could barely do one. There's no point in trying to go do something else, right? Because you figure, well, okay, this is taking a little time for me to really build and getting it out there, right? Well, now what's going to happen? You're going to find something else and you're going to get involved in there and you're going to try to understand that and try to do that and say, well, this didn't work for me because this one I'm doing, right? Again, you could be in multiple areas, but you be got to be able to handle multiple, right? Now, being the multitasker I am, I can find myself overwhelmed with all the things that are out there, right? It's almost, in, it is, as a matter of fact, it is impossible because there's not enough time in the day. Look, there's seven days in a week. 24 hours a day. Even if we were to add a couple more days and a few more hours, all we're going to do 
is take up that other time that's mailed available. So if there was an eighth or ninth day and more than 24 hours in a day, as silly as that may sound to some of you, but that's why I said it. Because some will understand what I'm saying. There's just not enough time, not enough days to do what we need to do. And not to mention, time is the key and the essence of everything, right? And you should be in control of your own success and your own destiny. Are people going to drag you down? Are people going to make their certain little comments? You have to learn how to turn that and turn it into a positive. Or get yourself directed away from those types of people, right? Or and you can still be connected with them, but not be connected if that makes sense, right? You got to learn how to steer away from the technology. There's no, or that little negative, right? There's no need to keep going in back and forth, badgering one another, and this, that, thing. other. All it keeps doing is da da da. Now, on the flip side of that, you keep getting viewed. So on that side, it could be a good thing, right? Business model, you gotta love that idea, right? So listen, I'm gonna drop a few information in here. This is gonna go right into where my videos are with everything that I'm doing. My cannabis CBD product, maybe the oil, maybe for pets, and all the other fabulous products that are in there. You'd be surprised and you'd be amazed. And you've all seen my preview picture there, a photo where all the beautiful things that it can do and help with, right? And each person is going to be varied on their particular use. As I mentioned a couple weeks back ago on my other video. And we're just going to go from there, right? So why not join me? Go ahead. Share this with everybody that you know. And I also like to thank you for tuning in. We'll all see you again soon.